What is up guys? I'm Daddy Gamer Fred back again with another trailer reaction review. Today we're going to be checking out the Miss Marvel official first trailer. I'm excited. Miss Marvel was teased, spoiler alert, at the end of the last Avengers movie, Infinity War with Thanos, with Samuel Jackson trying to make a call before he died or disappeared or whatever the fuck evaporated. He was making a call to Mrs. Marvel. And me knowing that we're gonna bring Mrs. Marvel to the cinematic universe, I was like, where the one, where the fuck is she already? You know? And then on two, what is she doing that she's not in play during something as big as a Thanos fight as it was happening on Earth. Where the fuck is she? I'm not too into the, the Miss Marvel catalog of comics and shit like that, so I don't really know her core, you know, base story or backstory or whatever the case may be. If I'm not mistaken, I think that's where we're gonna get. I think this movie from images that they shown previously, I'm gonna have them up on screen. It's gonna be a origin story for Mrs. Marvel as, as far as it being, you know how she got her powers and stuff like that i think that's pretty cool because i don't know shit about mrs marvel and this is going to be a way for a casual fans like myself to get introduced to a person that has a big role in stuff like this as far as you know thanos going on and whatnot so let's jump into what is the first trailer for mrs marvel and let's dive right into this okay let's get into it Boom. Oh, that's that booming. There's a boom going on in the trailer. Ooh, hard fall. Black <laughs> lost the video? What? Probably at the last store up in Canada. I think it's in Canada. War is a universal language. I know a renegade soldier when I see one. Okay. It never occurred to me that one might come from above. Marvel Studios above. This is Samuel Jackson talking. Space invasion. Oh, she had a shield. Big car back chase. Ooh, all right. Told, I was ready to hang it up till I met you today. My boy. So young too. Around here. It's hard to explain. 2019. Next Keep year. Having these memories. I thought we were getting this this year. I see flashes. I think I had a life here. Okay. But I can't tell if it's real. Ooh. Was she made? Or was she abducted? We have no idea what threats are out there. Oh, Brandy alone. got snow. Carson. We need you. There you go. I'm not what you think I am. There we go. There you go. All right. March 2019. Okay. That was that was okay. As far as uh introduction trailer for what we're gonna be seeing in the movie, it looked good. It looked good. It, it looked good. It looks on a scale of Marvel movies, it looks better than um the first Captain America movie, but at the same time, it feels like it's in that same boat as I wanted to, to call it. It's like, it looks good. It, it doesn't look like it's gonna be the oh my God moment of a movie. And I don't know what is making me say that. And maybe it's because of the emptiness I have for Mrs. Marvel. Right now, I'm clueless on who the fucking bad guy could be or what's her origin story. Even after watching the fucking trailer, I'm clueless. And it's like a lot of, I got the puzzle and I'm just starting and I'm learning the pieces and where everything goes and fits. As of right now, it's a confusing mess and I'm loving the look of the puzzle on the box, but I don't love 
um, the fucking process I gotta go through to put the pieces together, if that makes any sense. Let's rate the trailer. The trailer looks amazing. There's a lot of scenes in it that show Miss Marvel getting into different actions, like the flip over the train, shooting her arms and shit, flexing her powers. There's a lot of backstory that shows like a little girl growing through like stages of her life and then ending up in the military and stuff like that. I don't know if that leads to her getting abducted or ending up in fucking space. I don't, again, I don't know what the fuck is going on. I'm pretty sure someone's gonna explain it all to me in the comment section below, but it's just one of those things that I'm like, uh -huh, I want to know the answers to. And I know I could just one quick Google search to find the answers to, but guys, this is like how I absorb these movies and absorb the Marvel Universe is just through watching the movies. And that's how I prefer to do it as a fan, as a, as, as I call myself a true casual Marvel movie fan. I don't claim to be into the comic book lore and stuff like that. And I don't think you have to, to kind of, you know, develop a relationship with these movies. Now, again, if I have to give this trailer a score, I'm going to have to give it a four because as I was describing it, moving back to the puzzle piece analogy, it looks like a great puzzle. It looks like something I want to dive into and find out more about. Did this trailer do that for me? Not really, but it sold me a seat. I am 100% wanting to watch this day one in movie theaters, guaranteed. And that has to do a lot with it being after such a great movie as Infinity War. And at the same time, I know this is going to connect to Infinity War, even though it's going to be an origin story and the connection might just be a post scene credit shot or whatever. But just to know that they're, they're going to be inching towards a resolution to that story, I want to see this movie. Did that increase the grade of the trailer? Just slightly a little bit. I mean, there is stuff in the trailer, yeah, that it's cool and that it's making me want to be invested in this universe. And that's why this trailer, I have to give it a four. Again, it's a good trailer. There's nothing wrong with the trailer. If I have, the, the reason why I didn't give it a five, it was just nothing exciting that made me like, oh shit, it was no old shit moment. There was no like Tony Stark coming from the future or whatever the fuck. It was, it was nothing to me that made me jump out of my chair excitedly besides the fact that I know that this is connecting to the Infinity War ending or whatever the case. But obviously, this is just my opinion. And obviously, as you guys know, all of my videos, open discussion. Let me know what you think in the comment section below from the trailer, what score you would give it, your hype level, anything you want to fill me in. And let's, you know, I answer all comments. Let's have that discussion in the comment section below. Peace. I will see you guys on the next trailer reaction review. Like always, guys, I'm Daddy and my Fred on Instagram and Twitter. And you guys can bring the comments conversation there. I'm the American Gamer in Switzerland right here on YouTube. And yes, I'm going to be doing a ton of videos just like this one. So if you enjoy, please hit that subscribe button. Also hit the like button. It does help me out a ton as far as growing the channel is concerned. Ring the bell if you want to be notified on the next time I drop a video. Peace. I'm going to see you guys on the next one.